Hello! In case you aren't familiar, I moved to California from Delaware three years ago. So now every year towards the end of December, I fly back home to spend time with my mom and the rest of my family. And usually I take a break from posting, but this time I wanted to bring y'all along. So let's start off with a very tired me. Hi. My voice sounds crazy. It is 4.48 in the morning. I'm running on about three and a half hours of sleep, which is fine. Not the end of the world, because most of the time that I fly home, I stay up all night. I figured I would get at least a little hours, a little nap in before this one. But yeah, we're about to fly. My dad is on his way to pick me up, take me to the airport. It's like a two hour drive almost. The good thing about going at this time of day is there's like no traffic, so that's cool. <laughs> I'm leaving the squirrel for two weeks, but I got people coming to check on her and feed her and stuff, so she'll be good. My voice sounds crazy. I'm not sick. Ha 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 Yeah. Anyway, let's get into OOTD. Why do I keep squinting? Hey. F*** a fancy airport outfit. I will never understand that. You're gonna be sitting in a seat for six hours. Why would you not want to be comfortable? This sweater that I got from Target, no dents, Crystalia merch, and these sweatpants that I've owned for a stupid amount of years and wear stupid often to a point where my mom roasts me about them constantly. She hates them, I don't really know why, so I'll definitely hear something about it when I, when I get there. Okay, I'm gonna get some water and try to rise a little more before my dad gets here. I fly out of the San Francisco airport because even though it's a much further drive from my house, I'm able to take a direct flight without having to change planes. Oh, you can kind of see me. Hello. We're rolling. The light is like perfectly in your eyes right now. Oh, you're talking to me? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, everybody? Uh, how far are we? We're, get, we're close, kind of, right? We're probably about... 15 minutes from there. We're approaching. Alright, you can't see me. Bye. They're always so festive. Happy Christmas, y'all. This is me mentally preparing because I really hate airports. A lot. You never know what shit is gonna get handed to you, dude. Thankfully, this time wasn't too bad. Everything went pretty chill. I checked my bag and waited for a wheelchair to take me to the gate. I'm only explaining this for the people that have never seen my videos before, but yes, I can walk. Haha. -ha. But, <coughs> oh god. <coughs> I'm fine. But I got asthma like really bad. Also restrictive lung disease and a bone condition. So carrying a heavy backpack through a massive airport by myself isn't the greatest idea. Plus you get to skip the security line and that's kind of cool. But don't, don't, <laughs> don't get a wheelchair for that, all right? I made it to my gate, but I was really hungry. And thankfully there were a few food places nearby. So I stopped at one and got a stupidly overpriced BLT. And it wasn't even that good either. I really hate filming myself in public, so. This part was uh was really fun. This is very weird. I feel like somebody's gonna look at me. Then I made it back to my gate in time for boarding. Aha. I once saw someone in a vlog in like 2010 where they touched the outside of the plane for good luck and literally ever since then, I've been doing that. I tried to get my hand doing it, but I missed, of course. Just know that that was happening. Then I went to find my seat, but I was too short to see the numbers, so I had to ask the guy behind me. <laughs> Is this 18? Uh, next one. Okay, thank you. Yo, check this shit out, it's me. Me. This is the first time I can talk to the camera without feeling completely insane. Um, I don't want to jinx it, but everything 
has gone pretty smoothly so far. No delay, no people refusing to take me in the wheelchair, no getting lost, no missing my boarding. Also, this plane is large. I don't remember if I've ever flown on a plane like this before. Now I just get to sit for the next six hours. I rented Toy Story 4 and the Santa Claus on iTunes. I'm gonna live my life. I also spent $30 to get an adapter for my headphones for my phone because I left mine at home. <laughs> it's fine. It wasn't fine because it didn't even work. And then we were off, my brothers. Um, I don't know what that water is. It wasn't raining. I guess this, the plane was just wet. It looks kind of cool, I guess. I don't know. Then by some miracle, I managed to fall asleep in like 30 minute chunks. And about three and a half hours into the flight, it was bathroom time. I don't know if that's the altitude, but I'm not asking this. I'm not having a good time. I drank a lot of water, so I was there for a while. We have an hour and a half left. I'm struggling. It's so uncomfortable in that seat. Speaking of uncomfortable, here's a weirdly close shot of me washing my hands. Let's return to the suffering. I didn't suffer too much though because I got to watch about half of this movie before it was time to land. But at some point I had to put my laptop away and then was forced to listen to the screaming, coughing child. I wouldn't be surprised if literally everyone on that plane got sick. Shout out to you, child. Then we land in Philadelphia. It's not Southern, so I don't know why I said it like that, but the sun was already setting when we got there, so I didn't really see any sunlight aside from inside of an airplane. Now, usually when you get a wheelchair to your departing gate, they also have one waiting for you when you arrive. But of course this time they didn't, so I had to awkwardly ask the gate agent. Excuse me. Can I get a wheelchair to the baggage claim? Sure, Thanks. Before long, I was zoom zooming my little way to baggage claim. I didn't even have to wait an hour for my bag. It's a Christmas miracle, dude. And the nice wheelchair man helped me get it off the carousel. Thank you. Then I looked at the current temperature and got sad. But not that sad, because like I wanted to snow. Traffic was an absolute disaster, but eventually my grandparents made it and saved me from the hell that is the Philadelphia airport. <laughs> One hell of a ride home. Yeah. That's right, another hour of sitting in a vehicle. It's fine though, because basically I was there, so it doesn't matter. Baby! Hey! 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 Oh, hey. hey. <gasps> Bee Bee! Hi, Bee! Hey. Bee Bee! Oh, wow. Is this good? Oh, wow, it looks really good. Girl, it's like totally missing. Ooh, dude. Yeah, it's I so it. cozy in here. Yeah. Good. Yeah. That's exactly what I wanted. Look, look at the snowman top. Yeah. Isn't that a cool? You know me and my snowman. <laughs> she looks really good. You think? Yeah. Good. Her Thanks. hair looks good. Yeah, I brush them more. <laughs> In the middle of the night, she drags around her little toys. Yeah. You know, and does that. Come here. Oh my god, it's amazing. Hey, Beepa. Oh, happy to see you. Hey, Beepa. This one? You'll notice talks a lot now. Really? Hi, baby. 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 Yeah. <laughs> Say hi. Say hi. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> I don't know how yeah, she rat. is. No, you don't. I look. Look at my face. I'm hungry. Why haven't you had me? <laughs> Just stinky, stinky breath. Just sweating. She's old. Yeah. She's 17. I mean, old. Uma, she's. She's 17. What? She does not look 17. Yep. No, like, I was expecting her to look like 
Oh, yeah, no, she is just, <laughs> believe me, Taylor. She'll drive you a little nuts, probably. I mean, you know who I live with? I know who you live with. Hey, do you mind? You're not supposed to be up there. Damn. My little tray. Yippee -ki -ki Look at the dancing Santa. Yeah. Well, it plays music, look, but it won't dance. I tried to fix it. Well, it's like 15 years old. Oh. Hey. Hey. This is what he would do. He would get... Yeah. Well, no, he would dare hold this. Now you remember better than me. Yeah. Your entire essence is Christmas right I now. I know. Well, this is what I wore to work, the shirt. But just, it's so funny. Like, the house is so Christmas, it's and then Christmas you're just Christmas, Christmas threw Christmas up, too. dude. Christmas threw up? Santa threw up. Oh, man. Beep up! Look at this little cute little Christmas tree. And look, come over here. <laughs> this is your little ornament. It says Taylor on it. Oh, yeah. And look, this little snowman says Taylor on it, too. Uh, I remember those. Okay. Who made that? Those Hello? Look. You turn the light on. Jingle uh, Day. Hooray, it's Jingle Day. That was the day Taylor was born. Hooray, it's Jingle Day. <laughs> and look. Yes. Your little oh. tiny, teeny, weeny foot. Ew. No. I thought you were pointing to that. The oh. squirrel. Pee pee. Oh, oh my I guess you say hi. Yeah. Baby. Yeah. I'm yeah. here. Oh, look, look. What? I know. Yeah. From what? Oh, now we can't have that there. It's gonna be here. <laughs> nice. All right. All right. This is the so end. We'll see you soon. Yeah. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> I told them you were gonna roast my pants, I, and you did. I'm sorry. You did. They're just gray I sweatpants. I hate them. Do you know how long she's had these pants? But why do you hate Probably them? Probably like 15 years. Okay. Whoa. Not quite. I'm exaggerating a little bit, but probably like I've eight not had years. <laughs> she's had them forever. I hate them. Why? They're she just. She loves them. It's great, and they're comfortable for her. And that's I. I'm not. They're just sweatpants. Why? I guess because <laughs> because we've <laughs> had them so long. It's like, will you put them to rest? <laughs> you know how hard it is for me to find clothes, especially pants. Look, honey, I know. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, it's so funny. Look. <laughs>